Not all celebrities say no, no, no when it comes to rehab. Hey everyone, it's Skylar with today's Celebrity Bites. After three weeks of undergoing treatment for an alcohol problem, singer Bobby Brown has checked himself out of rehab. The new edition star has been taking every little step he can to make his March 2012 DUI arrest go away, and entering rehab was part of the plea deal. But now that he's out, let's see what other celebrities have checked themselves in. Corey Monteith didn't exactly sing and dance his way through high school. In fact, the Glee star confessed to skipping school to get drunk and smoke pot at age 13. By 16, he said he had a full-on problem, and at 19 years old, he was in rehab. Rom-com star Gerard Butler was on the hunt for help in 2012 to treat his substance abuse issues and did so at the Betty Ford Center in California. While it was an addiction to painkillers that landed Grey's Anatomy star Eric Dane in an LA rehab clinic in 2011. David Duchovny proved he had a lot more in common with his Californication character than we thought when he entered a rehab facility for sex addiction in 2008. Actress Eva Mendez caught a lot of us off guard when word spread she entered Utah's Surf Lodge to help conquer her substance abuse. And although it wasn't exactly a surprise, it was nice to hear that party animal Mike Sorrentino was doing something about his prescription medication situation. He too sought help at Cirque Lodge, and it looks like the party is finally over.